Today I want to come to you with four quick and easy natural hairstyles. This is a three-day twist out, old twist out. So I want to start off with rough, dry looking hair. I love to use this creamy oil hair moisturizer by Cream of Nature. It is the best. I love this hair moisturizer. I use it all the time. And I'm just going to apply this to my strands. And I'm really going to force this product into my hair. As you all know, if you've been with me any length of time, I have low porosity hair. So I really have to force products in my hair. I'm going to use the spray bottle just to spray a little bit of water on my hair. Not to really soak it and revert it. I just want to dampen my hair just to make sure that this oil moisturizer is really saturating my hair, penetrating the hair shafts. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. to focus this also on the ends of my hair because my ends are the driest so I really want to make sure that product is on the ends as well so I'm taking a wide tooth comb and just combing through and making sure everything is detangled you do not want any knots or any you know you can actually finger detangle as well just gonna part it just with the finger not anything I do not really need it really straight okay and I'm just gonna take a just a bristle brush just to make sure those hair the hair is in place you know just to make sure it lays down properly And what I'm going to do now, I'm just kind of twisting the hair, just, you know, twisting it to midpoint. And then I'm going to take a trusty bobby pin <laughs> and secure it in place. take this all the way around but I decided not I'm just gonna take one of my rubber bands it's, it, it's not a, a tie but it doesn't have any metal anything it's great for these type of hairstyles I'm just gonna make a ponytail because what I want to do is create a puff I'm just kind of pull it a loose you know make it a little puffy and I just like to loosen that up on the side a little bit And this is basically the look once I lay these edges down a little bit. <laughs> I like that texture type look, you know. And this is basically it. It would look a little neater if I had a mirror in the back. So you guys forgive me about that. But this is just the basically the, what I wanted you to see this look. I really like this. It's so cute and just an everyday look for me. This next look for me is one of my favorite. It is the classic rolling tuck. I love this look. It's so classy to me and so sophisticated. So yeah, I'm just gonna roll and then secure it with a bobby pin and do the same thing all around my hair.
And if I had a mirror, I would definitely hide or secure those bobby pins a little bit better. I usually do. <laughs> but for the video, I just really want you to see how I do the back and the side. So, yeah. And we're going to go ahead and continue to tuck. We're going to continue to roll and tuck, roll and tuck. <laughs> okay, now you could actually leave it out like this if you like, but I do not want to leave it all the way out. It looks kind of cute like this too, but I'm going to go ahead and Roll and tuck all of it. Tuck and roll. Roll and tuck. <laughs> this is like a really great way to protect your hair and have it look cute, I believe, all at the same time. I just, I, this is one of my favorite styles. And then you go back once you have it complete and just any little areas that you want to tuck a little bit more, you know, just roll and tuck it a little bit more secure. So yeah. Again, I would hide the bobby pin, the bobby pins a little bit better, but yeah, no mirror. So you get what I'm trying to say, though. <laughs> All right, this next one, I'm just gonna comb the hair out, really. Um, just kind of comb it all the way out because the next one is one of my favorite styles as well It's good. It's like the big afro puff. Okay, so I could not find my black tie So I'm gonna use my jean looking tie <laughs> or just any kind of tie that you need you can tie You can it can be a scarf or anything just I, I, I want to tie this and then pull the hair up a little bit Secure it with the bobby pin and then with the hair I will hide the tie. I love this fluffy tight um, afro puff is what I like. I love it because it's big. It's just full. I love it. This is a really quick, quick hairstyle. This next one is my favorite. You guys see me wear this all the time. I love this one. This is the quick and easy style for me. And you can add gel to it to just make it a little sleeker. But I really do like that textured look. Sometimes I will add gel, but sometimes I will not. So today I do not want to add gel. I just really want that textured nat natural look. And I'm just securing it, tying it, putting it back in like a, I'm um, using my Rubber, it's not a rubber band, it's my little tie. And then I'm taking this old braid hair. I just, this is some old braid hair, textured braid hair, and I have added a rubber band, like the little bad hair, hair band that I have now on. I just added it to the end, and, <laughs> and now I'm just gonna apply it to my hair like this. It's the same color, just about the same color, and twist it, and I'm going to use this to make my top knot. I love that this is one of my favorite to go type of looks this hair this top knot one of my favorite hair looks and I just really secure this twist this securely around all the way around until it looks like a knot up to, on top of your hair and then I secure it with a bobby pin I use maybe sometimes a couple but I just look like I need one down the bottom and then I take one another bobby pin and put it straight down the middle so that way it secures all the hair. And this is basically it, guys. I have really thank you so very much for watching this video. If you like these type of videos, give me a thumbs up. Love you guys so much. Peace and love until next time. Bye.